Hello everybody, it's Mark and welcome back to Ice Cream Meltdown. This is the Milk Bar brand ice cream and today's flavor is pie. P-I-E. Um, so what stood, what stood out to me when I was shopping for ice cream at Harmon's like I showed on my last video, uh, the shop with me one, um, was that this one has a deep vanilla ice cream. I've had a lot of vanilla ice cream. I've never had a deep vanilla ice cream. And then it has gooey butter filling with toasted oat crust. Uh, so the Milk Bar is an ice cream shop in New York City that I hear is amazing. I've never been there. I definitely will go next time I'm in New York. Um, and I, I tried the cornflake flavor, which was really good. That was like my favorite one of last few months. Um, and then I tried the birth cake, birthday cake one, which was not that good. Um, it was okay, but like my expectations were really high. So this will be like a tiebreaker to say like, is the Milk Bar an awesome brand and what can you expect? So it has this Exo Tosi. We ripped that off. That looks like, it looks like a Dulce de Leite um, flavor because it's got like that little off-white color, a little bit of, it looks like caramel, but it's some sort of, gooey butter filling. So let's take a scoop of that, um, put that in our bowl. And I tried to find a bowl that matched the container. I have a bunch of different colors, but not that that really matters to anybody. Let's take a bite. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. It kind, it kind of does have like a, a buttery dulce de leite flavor. Actually, it looked like that. And it kind of does taste like that. Mm. Wow. See, it says here, butter filling. So I didn't really know what that meant. That's what the filling is right there. See, it's that stuff. It tastes just like a buttery caramel flavor. And the deep vanilla. I'm trying to gauge like, what is the difference between a normal vanilla and a deep vanilla? Is there like a shallow vanilla or like, does that just mean they put more vanilla in there? Mmm, pretty good. There's a pretty big list of ingredients. It has a few things like milk bar pie filling, milk bar flavor base. So they've got like a few trademark type flavors, I guess, on there, which they're famous for. And it has these little bits of oat mixed into there. It's like kind of throughout. Mm. It's good. Really good. Of the milk bar flavors, my favorite was the cornflake one. That was even better than this, in my opinion. But this is tasty. And then the this one's probably just a little bit less than that. I think I gave that like a 9 out of 10. I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10. It's delicious. It's got a caramely flavor deep vanilla i still haven't grasped like what does that really mean maybe it's just like some deep thoughts or something and then the birth cake won a little after that so i'm giving this eight out of ten it's from the milk bar it was like five dollars for a container of this which is a you know normal price for a pretty gourmet tasting ice cream it's got 220 calories 16 grams of sugar for two-thirds a cup so Compared to that topped Ben and Jerry's one that I had the other day, that one had like 430, I think. It was way more calories than this. This one's better, in my opinion. It tastes better. Um, that one, actually, I felt a little bit like stomach ache afterward. This one, I'm feeling better already. I know this is a good choice. So check it out if you can find it. It's not easy to find. Not a lot of stores have it. Or if you're in New York City, go try the milk bar. Um, leave me a comment if you have tried this and tell me what your opinion is. Do you like this flavor? Is it good? It's pretty good. I gave it an eight. So thanks for watching. This is Mark from Ice Cream Meltdown and we'll see you again soon.